हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई वेलकम यू अगेन ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो फ्रेंड्स इन द लास्ट टू वीडियोस वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ माउंटेनियरिंग इक्विपमेंट्स एंड माउंटेन टर्मिनोलॉजी आई होप यू हैव सीन दीज वीडियोस एंड लर्न ए लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स डो डे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न हाउ टू टाई डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ नोट्स सो फ्रेंड्स लेट्स बी गेम बिफोर स्टार्टिंग यू मस्ट हैव टू नो अबाउट वट इज द बेसिक डिफरेंस बिटवीन ए नोट एंड हिच फ्रेंड्स बेसिकली ए नोट एंड हिच वो था ए ट्विस्ट ऑन द रोप बट ए नोट डजेंट नीड एनी स्पोर्ट फॉर इट्स एग्जिस्टेंस ऑन द अदर एंड ए हिच ऑलवेज नीड स्पोर्ट फॉर इट्स एग्जिस्टेंस दिस इज द बेसिक डिफरेंस बिटवीन ए नोट एंड हिच नाउ जनरली देर आर सिक्स टाइप्स ऑफ नोट्स वी विल लर्न टू टाई ईच नोट वन बाय वन For to tie a safety knot, you have to hold the rope one to two feet away from one end, and rotate this end through one eighty degree around the rope. Now, pass this end through the loop, and then pull the rope by holding at both ends. This is the simplest knot which we use to tie in our daily life. This knot is used to provide safety to all other knots and hitches. This knot is also called thumb knot and overhand knot. Figure of 8 knot. There are three types of figure of 8 knot. Figure of 8 without loop, figure of 8 with single loop, figure of 8 with double loop. Now let's see how to tie figure of 8 without loop. The procedure is same as that of safety knot, but the only difference is that in this case you have to rotate the free end throw 360 degree around the rope now pull the rope by holding at both hands this will result in a figure of 8 knot figure of 8 knot without loop is used when you have to make base or you have to anchor yourself without the help of carabiner the process to tie figure of 8 with single loop and figure of 8 with double loop is same as that of figure of 8 without loop the only change is that you have to fold the rope one time in case of figure of 8 with single loop and you have to fold the rope two times in case of figure of 8 with double loop as you can see in these videos easily all these figure of 8 knots are used anchoring and base making joint knot there are two types of joint knot seat man knot and fisher man knot the seat man knot is used to join two ropes having unequal diameters and the fisher man knot is used to join two ropes having equal diameters on the screen you can see how we can join two ropes having unequal diameters with single seat man knot the purpose of double seat man knot is also same that is to join two ropes having unequal diameters but the double seat band knot provide greater safety to the joint as compared to single seat band knot single fisher man knot single fisher man knot is easy to tie as you need only to tie safety knot on the joining end of one rope by the joining end of another rope in this way you can join two ropes having equal diameters double fisher man knot for to tie double fisher man knot you have to rotate the joining end two times around the rope to tie a safety knot as compared to single fisherman knot the function of double fisherman knot is same as that of single fisherman knot but similarly to double seat man knot it also provide greater safety to the joint as compared to single fisherman knot
thief knot for to prepare thief knot you have to make two loops on each side of the rope now pull these loops through one another this will result in a thief knot thief knot is used to make bridge by combining a number of balli reef knot reef knot is used to prepare seat harness when you have not any ready made harness or in case of any emergency for to tie a reef knot first you have to take a 12 ft long rope sling and then you have to tie two safety knot on your waist as shown in the video after doing this you have left with two free ends then pass these two free ends between your legs and tie two safety knot on both side of your waist as shown in the video now your harness is ready and you can insert your carabiner inside the two safety knots double knot first prepare a figure of eight knot with single loop having loop length 3 to 4 feet then follow the procedure as shown in the video After following you will be left with two loops You have to place one of the loop over your ribs and the another loop over your shoulder and under the arm opposite to that shoulder After doing this you have to tie a figure of eight knot on the free end Thus you have prepared your chest harness and you can go for climbing so friends this was all about knots thank you friends for watching my video please like share and subscribe thank you friends